Single player selected. Gotta be on my A game shit pants. You are on A game. You, Chris Redfield, for crying out loud. Uh, that is that is true. Alpha team. And maybe not Barry Burton. Not Barry Burton. Was Barry Burton A Alpha or Bravo? How dare you ask a question like that, Chip? Of course he was Alpha. Okay. Have you not seen his beard? <laughs> That's an Alpha beard. <laughs> and welcome back, friends. You join us back on the awesome Resident Evil on the PlayStation. Now. We're tooled up, Chip Pants. Oh, let me dump this stupid... Ribbon. <laughs> ribbon. That's going to be no good. We're going to head back, peoples. Back to the mansion. Because we've got a new key. So what Wesker was saying, basically there's been a door that you haven't been able to unlock with any key. While Wesker was busy wasting ammo. Yeah, he may be out of ammo. We're not out of ammo. I'm mm. eager to see this shotgun... Life, oh, you're going to like it. Oh, hello. The old bleeping, that mean, must mean the radio. <laughs> shh, shh, listen, people. This is Brad. I know you can't answer me. But somehow, This is Chris. Brad, can you hear me? Damn. Oh, he just smashed the radio. Did he just smash the radio? What? He's trying to make it work, Pug. Ugh. This is what you would do. This Chris Redfield, I tell ye. Ye, you. Ye? <laughs> There's a mix of ye and you. Ye, you. <laughs> uh, should I pinch some herbs? Pugman, I think you've got plenty. You've got Sod more it. in your chest drawer. I'm taking them, shit pants. <sighs> Always with the top up. I can't fit anymore. You can't fit anymore. I can't fit anymore. What was I thinking? It's... Crud. All right. You daffy duck in your herbs. Gotta watch out for these bloody dogs. Just make tons of noise as you're running past them. Does <laughs> that will that help me, Chip Pants, or will that get me killed quicker? <laughs> For the shot. Well, this is our first PlayStation game we're playing, Chip Pants. Oh, that's true. What do you think? Good to be playing the old PlayStation. Miss the old crappy polygonal graphics. I've never played a PlayStation, Pug. You've played the play PlayStation 2 at least. The PlayStation 2? You've played it with me, I'm sure, at some point. PlayStation 1? Buster Move Wait a 2, second. Chip Pants. Remember Buster Move 2? Final Fantasy 8? Was that on? Which PlayStation yeah, was that Final one Fantasies. on? Yeah, Final Fantasies. The first one? That was on the first... Seven, seven and eight. No, I mean, like, uh... That was on PlayStation 1? Yeah. Oh, well, dang, I played the PlayStation. You played the heck out of it. <laughs> Love Final Fantasy VIII. All right, now, I know we're talking generally about nicely family-friendly things. Aye. Like the PlayStation. But this bit coming up... It's... It's difficult, to say the least, and it's scary. It's a rated R. We're chatting PG-13. Oh, I hate this bit coming up. Wish me luck, peoples. Good luck. Wish me you got luck. me a bit worried now. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm nervous, Chip Pants. I'm sweating. You got a shotgun. Just rub the shotgun. I'm going to keep this shotgun close to me. <laughs> Just stroke your gun. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Is that where we just came from? Oh, no. Oh, no. Flippin' hell. They figured out how to open doors, bud. <laughs> Say hello, friends. To the hunter. <laughs> Eat that! <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> it's worse than a pug that wants food. Oh, bad. Look at this thing. Was that bad? Look at it. That was quite funny. It looks like something from the swamp thing. <laughs> Chip pads, these things are not funny. They will cut your head off. Look at them claws, Pug. Look at them. And, and he smells like seaweed. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. So, Hunter. But the Hunter's dead now. We're good now. 
They are all over the mansion. Oh, no. They've infested? Not looking forward to this bit. What's if I'm going to die, yeah. it's going to be coming up soon. It's not going to happen, Pug. Right, now, is there anything good for Pugman? Don't think all negative. Oh, I can't carry those. But we're definitely going to need that. Can you just drop a herb? Drop the crappy spritzy one. I need my herbs. Have you not seen that green thing that came running at me? You shot it to Kingdom Come, Pug. You're fine. He took three shotgun blasts to the face. Yeah, your zombies take more than that. Not shotguns, they don't. <laughs> right, I'm going to go to the safe room. Oh, you hear those footsteps, shit pants? Uh, crap. Take a seat. You know actually, him. what they look like, Pug? Like Kermit the Frog if he if he s sniffed a load of crack or something? <laughs> no, Pug. What do they look like? They look like the evil gremlins. Oh, what's this? You know... Uh. I'll put some bullets in the back room. Use them in case of trouble, Wesker. Hmm. I thought he was out of bullets. That's nice of him. He shared some. We have insight to what this guy's going to come in, be come into, Pugman. I don't, I don't. Don't you be spoiling stuff, Chip Pants. See the shotgun. Don't you be spoiling <laughs> stuff. I'm looking at you right now, Chip Pants. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. Well, what did he leave us? One magazine and some shotgun shells. I think he wants us killed. Mm. I don't trust. You know, something about that whisker, Chip Pants. I don't trust him. You know, something about him, Pug. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's those shades. <laughs> At night time, right? You can't trust that. At night time and indoors. Alright, well I will take the shells though. Pick them shells. Where's the first aid spray? It's a funny looking first aid spray. <laughs> nice. Okay, so right, looks like a hydrogen peroxide bottle. What should I take? I'm not taking that rubbish. Um, That's good, right? Maybe one more mixed herb. Oh, Pug, you're feeling, you are feeling nervous. Um, I am, I'm feeling nervous, friends. All right. Do you want to save it here? You that nervous? No, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna try and minimize my saves as much as I can. Trying to think even where I need to go. Oh, you know what? Let's you gotta go back. You gotta go back to that room and get that thing you were, couldn't pick up. I'm gonna dump some more stuff. Told you. <laughs> Taking too much health. Um. It'll be okay, Pugman. Okay. I'm happy with that. Are they poisonous, these things? No, but um, you won't care about the poison when you've got no head attached to your body. <laughs> Wait a second, you got to go back, Pug. Why? There's something in that room. Oh, yep. See, I'm frazzled. These, these things frazzle me. It's okay. I'll go back down the stairs. You're okay. Saved me a lot of trouble there, Chip Pants. Good. That's what I'm here for, Pug. Sometimes. Uh, oh, it's this room here. Sounds like we're going back outdoors. Uh, no, this room. This is the room. Switch the old light on. And there was this here. Will you take the magnum rounds? Yes. Magnum? Oh yeah, yes we will. Why does it look like a little mini atom bomb? <laughs> don't know, you know. Doom book? We will take the doom book. <laughs> I don't like the sound of that book. Is there anything else here? Nothing uncommon. 
can only see the moonlight and a dense forest. I'm feeling pretty good about them dogs out front, Pug. I think we can take them with the shotgun. Maybe we should just go and take our I'm chance. I'm saving all my bullets for those green toady things coming at me. <laughs> no, I mean out front. What drove us into the mansion to begin with? Oh, that's true. Raccoons, wasn't it? <laughs> right, dump the cr dump the crud off. Yeah, I can leave the book. The Doom book. Leave the Magnum rounds. Do I need this? I'll Just take this case. with me. Yeah. Alright, hold on one sec, friends. I need to s sort something out because I think it's lagging a little bit. I'll be right back. I'm back. Sorry about that, friends. Should be a little bit better. Okay. I think we need to... Head upstairs, chip pants. Let's go. I think that's what that key's gonna open up. Something upstairs. Something upstairs. <laughs> yeah, these gremlin guys aren't too bad, Pugman. Just just feed them something. They're all full. Oh. There's one back there. We you can don't shoot see them you. in the back. Oh. Don't be afraid to shoot these bastards in the back, people. They deserve it. <laughs> Whoa! How is he taking? Oh, he's a strong sod. All right. How many pistols do you think they'd take? So you scream, buddy. I don't even want to think how many pistols they take. And we've not been in this door here. Hmm? Ah. Now, actually... Flat screen TV? Not quite a flat screen TV. It's actually a paper map. Ah. Which, if we use the lighter on the fire, we could get the map. But I don't really need it. I kind of know the mansion. Kind of well. <laughs> okay. There is a herb here. So I'm going to take it. Through here. Okay. This is the door that you hadn't been in before? We have not been in this room before. All right. Oh, God. Just a normal room, Pug. Which... A checkered floor room. It is boss time, chip pants. A deep breath. Do you remember old Yawn? The spite, I mean the, the snake. Yes. From House Slytherin. It's going to be oh, back. Oh, crap. Look at him! He's an inside-out snake! Didn't get a good look at him before. Zombie snakes doesn't get any worse than this. Shotgun like the me. hell out of him. Come on. Whoa, 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 Come whoa, on, big whoa. boy. Whoa. Reload. Your yellow fawn. Oh, yeah. He's toast. Pug, man. Oh, yes. I'm feeling good, chip pants. You, you just... I'm feeling good. You get me good. all nervous. You're pumping that gun. I'll see you watching me up there, chip pants on the camera. <laughs> I'm feeling good. I nod my camera back at you. You're doing fine. <laughs> okay, now we need to go down in this hole. Ah. But I warn you, friends, once you go down, you cannot come back up. So if, if you're Jill at this point, you can go down. But if you want the good ending with Jill and save um, Barry Burton... You need to wait till he drops the rope. You've been warned. <laughs> Doesn't mean much to me at this point. Oh, it will do. It will do. You just hold on there, chip pants. What is this? Yeah, what is this? There's a switch below you. Will you push it? Yes. Now, I'm kind of worried at this point because the last time I saved was back at the old cabin. So if I screw up, I'm going to have to go all the way back. I asked you, Pug, if you wanted to save. You're like, no, I didn't want to use this. That was my to ego me. talking. I, I shouldn't have listened. You shouldn't have listened to me. Oh, my God. Hold on. This guy's interrupting my let's play, you <laughs> dirty sod. Come here, you. 
Boom! Yep. Who took it? Boom! Splashed his guts all over the sidewalk. <laughs> Music's changing, Kevin. Ooh! That's right. Neil to Chris Redfield. <laughs> You got this, Pugman. For me, coming up, I think Top it's up. the most difficult bit. In Top the game. up, Pugman. I think you only got two shells. Oh, thank you, Chip Pants. Mm -hmm. Difficult bit coming up, you say? For me, probably the most difficult bit in the game. Whoa, okay. That's why I'm a, li I'm a little bit worried. About not having saved it. <laughs> Just, just be slow and steady. Oh, here's Munchin. <gasps> right, we're going to leave them two to uh, enjoy their meal. I'm not even going to disturb them. What if they're munching on Becca? Well, then she's screwed. <laughs> you unlocked it. What is that noise? Like, uh, uh. That's the atmospheric music. It's not a noise. It's lots of sparkles. No, no. No, no, no. Claw man? Oop, not a claw man. No. What is he? He's got some sort of opposable thumb. It's just a... What? A super so smart zombie. Who's just hungry, come down to the kitchen to get himself a sandwich and trick for Pugman plates. <laughs> He's dropped. That's it? I know, right? That's they, what that cutscene was about. Exactly. I kind of like, uh, overdid it for him. It wasn't that special. You, you're forgetting sparkles on I, the counter. You know what I am, aren't I? Um, I'm just worried about room. Maybe you top up on that uh, green plant, because you're only yellow fine. No. Oh, <gasps> bloody hell! Oh, oh, you stupid sod. Right. He's forced me to use it. Decided. You can kind of sneak round him, I think. Damn toe nibbler. <laughs> Wait, so have we passed the most stressful bit? Oh, no. Uh. All of this is stressing me out. I thought the zombie snacker was the one that did it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Back off. <laughs> it's kind of satisfying. <laughs> See the guts everywhere. Boosh. One to the nuts. That was a rude one, Pug. <laughs> that one must have really hurt. Because he's not even faking on the floor. <laughs> no, no grunting for him. Yeah, man. on. Bosh. Ooh. Got a library. You're, you're a good shot with oh, that, Pug. Oh, hold on. Not on the books. He's just reading. Not this year, he's not. <sighs> what was he reading? Scrapbook. Raccoon Times, May 27th. Animal attack. Woman mutilated. Around 10pm, a 20-year-old young woman's body was found by a passerby on the left bank of Marble River in the cider district of Raccoon City. Raccoon police assume it to be a grizzly or another animal do doing, animals doing because there are teeth marks along the mutated arms and left foot that show considerable power. Mm. Since she was wearing a, hi wearing a hiking boot on her remaining foot, it's been determined that she was attacked in the Arklay Mountains and fell into the river. They are hurrying to identify this woman. Monsters in Arklay Mountains. Some people claim they've seen monsters in Arklay Mountains. The monsters are supposedly about the same size as large dogs and usually run in a pack, as wolves do. This may sound like a group of ordinary wild dogs, but these monsters are surprisingly fierce and hard to hurt. They say these dogs won't bother you unless you wake them. So you, so you smart readers should stay out of the Arklay Mountains for the time being. But if you're looking for adventure, check it out. You wanna try? What the? It's actually encouraging you to die. It's like daring you. Mystery on the Arklay Mountains, mountain roadblock. Due to successive disasters in Arklay Mountains, the city authorities have decided to block the road leading to the foothills. 
At the same time, Raccoon Police intend to begin the search for lost people with the help of STARS team members. <sighs> they expect great difficulty because of the vast size of Arklay Mountains and the primeval forest that covers most of the area. Also, people are still reporting sightings of grotesque monsters in the mountains. Okay. So Johnny the zombie there was just having a little read of the newspapers. Uh, he was putting a scrapbook together. <laughs> okay, we can push this thing, little hidden door here. Ah. Uh... So that's what you had to do, Pugman. I guess when you figured out something would move, you just started going around shoving You just crap. go around shoving <laughs> everything, Jip Pants. That's how you do things. I can look over the courtyard from here. It's a helicopter port. Mm. If I could contact the other members from there. Okay. Looks like you we're going to be heading down there. What's on the table back there, Pugman? What's on the table? Let's have a looky say. A clip. I'm not even going to take that. It's beyond uh, pistols now, I'm afraid. Mm-hmm. Is that it? But behind you on that little table. There's something here. Ink ribbon. Mm -hmm. No, we've already got plenty. Going to leave that too. Yep. I think that's it in this room. All right, so a helicopter pad. Oh, yes. We can tell the chicken to come back and meet us there. I don't think we've been through this door. Ooh, someone's made a mess. Okay. There's a switch. Will you push it? Yes. Lights up a spot over there. Okay, we just push this statue across. What, in the spotlight? Yeah, it's just a little puzzle. The old shelf. Is that on properly? Come on. <laughs> There you go. Oh, a little nudge. Yes. <laughs> huh. Private little reading cool. room? Oh. What do we have in here? Oh. A MO disc or MO disc. We're going to be taking that. We. It's not vital for you to take these, but if you want the good ending, get them. You've got to take the MO. So we're going to, have to grab that. We need more MO. We need actually three more mo's, or two more mo's. mo's. We need three in total. More mo's, got it. I think that's it in here. We think Wesker and Becca and Jill and Barry are all up to. You know what? I don't know, Chip Pence. That's what we're going to figure out. I know Whisker's up to no good, though, obviously. Yeah, well... Uh, and uh, Rebecca's probably playing the piano, maybe. <laughs> but she's messing around with the chemicals. Barry Burton, probably kicking ass somewhere. <laughs> As for Jill, who knows? Oh, no. A Jill sandwich somewhere. <laughs> Don't know. <laughs> All right, we'll grab some Magnum ammo. Always grab the Magnum ammo. We probably. don't have a Magnum, though. We don't have a Magnum yet. You've got but high hopes, I guess. Is the best gun in the game. You've only got two shotgun shells in there, Pugman. That's sure awesome. Looking out for you, Pug. Oh, hello. Come on, buddy. Bosh. So you kind of wait for him to get. If he gets close, I can just drop him in one shot. Oh. Completely tear their head off from their neck. Got it. Good oh. lessons to learn. Shotgun ammo. Lovely. Thank you very much. And thank you very much. A battery. Now I can move the elevator in the courtyard. Okay, so well, I can't carry it now, but there is another elevator that we need to take in the courtyard later. So we're going to have to come back for this battery. Got it. Lipstick on the door. <laughs> yeah, tick tick mark on this one, Chip. Not put a B for, B for battery. <laughs> Not Barry. We're not putting Barry in there. What's down here? I 
Oh, hello. No, I'm not messing with them. Not today, sir. Got some plants, bud. You don't even have any room for the plants. Oh, now this corridor, it leads to a dead end around the corner. It's at the munchin. We're, we're leaving to his meal. Um, oh, no. Oh, he no, wants, no, no, no. He's no. a greedy sod, this one. <laughs> See, Ooh. that wasn't close enough. You can't risk it from that angle. You can't see it properly. Now, this door I've never been able to open. Huh. And now I know where it leads to, but if anybody knows in the comments how you open this door, I would love to know. I don't know if you can. Mystery. <laughs> oh, I bet this idiot's probably going to grab me, right? It's kind of like a dead-end corridor, but it... it I know where it leads to on the other side. It would be a shortcut to the other side. Back to the mansion. Is that the same thing like in, around the alchemy door? There was something on the other side that you couldn't move it. It's like, oh, get open it. So that was the plant. The plant was blocking it. Oh. So you could open that now. It would be a shortcut. Yeah. All right. We need to, I think we're done here. We just need to come back for the battery. Um, and there's a few herbs down there, if we need them. I think you're set on herbs, Pug. There's, not, there's like more than you can ever handle. Well, this next bit coming up, shit pants. I'm not looking forward to it. <laughs> so we're going to head back to the mansion. Well, we're in the mansion, but it's just upstairs here. Done the kitchen. Oh, he's stomping up. He's mad. <laughs> okay. Let me get a full loaded shotgun. If I'm going to die, it's going to be coming up. I need to get to the safe room, obviously, to dump all this crud. Yeah. So that's what we're going to do. But I need to work my way there. And there's going to be a ton of what you call them? Sea monster thingy majigs? <laughs> Swamp things. Swamp things. <laughs> Okay. Here we go. Wish me luck. Good luck. This bit here, you just need to fire like a maniac. Just keep firing. What the? I hear him screaming. Let him scream. There's one. Bosh. Oh my god. Two dirty sods down. There's one. God, they're ugly. Wow. Just enough shots as well. Which way do I need to go? There's the other fool. Mm. You're spraying and praying, Pug. <laughs> you better believe I'm praying. <laughs> I'm thinking, okay, this way I believe. Oh, God. You're all right, Pug. You're freaking me out. You're freaking me oh, out. I'm freaked out. I hate these things. Yes, they do jump too. Oh. He's not done yet. Oh, he's running. Oh. Oh. Okay. Tell me I've got bullets in my gun. Yeah, you got two. Boom. I'm not done yet. You're yellow fine. Yellow fine. Is there any more? That's right. You bleed out, pal. Send a message to the others. Oh. oh give me a shot like that. You... Oh. oh god. Oh god. Okay. You're fine. No, I'm I'm topping up shit pants. I'm not risking it. Watch your back. That was sneaky. He was waiting for you oh around the god. corner, Pug. It's an old game, but it still freaks me out, especially when I haven't saved in so bloody long. Is there any more? He's not stressing it, Pug, neither should you. Close to the safe room, it's just kind of around this corner. Easy does it. Oh, there's one there. I'm gonna get him in the back. The way they deserve to die. <coughs> oh. Come on. You're not dead. Bam. Go. Good shot, Pug. So doing great on ammo. I love how the shells tink out on the ground. That's one thing I really did love about the game when it 
first release. Like corn nuggets. Excuse me? Like corn nuggets. They come out like corn. That's what I've been thinking. It's like little bits of corn popping was... out. There's a dude around there. You could ignore him. He's all right. That's Steve. Just he ignore did. Steve around the corner. <laughs> Just run past him. Ah, oh, we made it. Feel better. A lot of stress is off me. And my hands are actually sweating now. Now, let's dump the old MO disc. We don't need that now. You did good, Pug. You did good. Um... So we need to go back for the battery. I'm going to take some herbs with me just in case. Don't need the magnum rounds. Let me grab the ink ribbon. I will get a little save in. Get a little save, Pug. Because that's a lot to redo. If, yes. If, if Steve decides to come alive. <laughs> I will not be a happy camper if I have to redo that. Yes. Okay. You dump off them ribbons. Dump the crappy ribbons. Do you feel better now? I do. <laughs> Get your save in. Alright, so we're going to head back. We're going to grab that battery. That's a long way to go back, too. But it should be a clear path, right? Oh. Except for Steve. Don't mind Steve. Oh. He's alright. He guards your, he guards your loot. <laughs> That's exactly what he does, yes. <laughs> I didn't even see the elevator to the courtyard that they're talking about. I don't remember seeing it. Am I going the right way? Yes, this way. The elevator to the courtyard. No, I kind of ran past it because there was a dog biting my ass. Yeah, that, that tends to make you move it along. Yeah. <laughs> Next time I have a chance, Chip Pants, though, I'll show you it. <laughs> stop, stop, stop. It was like the Terminator. See that noise? It's only coming from the kitchen. That's a creepy noise. It's quite a cool little sound effect. Hi. Elevator music. Da, 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 <laughs> Just to chill da, you out. Da, da, da. Is that from Blues Brothers, Chip Pants? I don't know. This is typical elevator music. Okay, the batteries in here. There was some little gribbon somewhere, I think. Yeah, but you still got tons back at the, the shop, yeah, right? Yeah, that's true. We can just leave them. All right, let's pinch the battery. Now, where are you headed, Pugman? Let me have a think. I'm going to head uh, basically back to the safe room. Oh, you know what? Oh, nice pinch that. A little planty. I'm going to head back to the safe room. I'm going to have to... What's going the wrong way? I'm going to have to dump some crud off. And then I'm heading... I need to get the Magnum gun. And that's still in the mansion. Okay. I'm just... I'll figure out where that is. I, f I think it's upstairs above the safe room. You'll see. But we wouldn't have come across it before? Like, it's is it behind, like, a locked room or something? We've not been in the room before because we couldn't unlock the room. Mm. So do we need a key with us? It doesn't look like we have a key. No, we've got this, this key here. Ah! At least coming back and forth, these uh, hunters, they stay gone. Like I'm not having to re-kill them. Oh, for sure. That'd be too unfair. They, they don't give you enough bullets. That'd be awful. There are a couple of sections in the game, though, where zombies do keep respawning. That's a bit mean on the kids. Yeah, they don't go easy on you, an old... The old Resident Evil. It's quite a difficult little game, if I, if I say so myself. 
Hi, Steve. Hi, Steve. Everybody say hello to Steve. <laughs> the anti friendly hunter in the game. <laughs> so, literally, like, can you walk right up to him and he don't. No, move? you don't hang around there long. <laughs> he will cut your head off. That's, I just whip past him. Um, Alright, dump the battery for the moment. Let's well dump that herb. Dump this. Okay, Someone's, we're gonna head upstairs. Someone's living on the edge, walking around with no plants. Got Mr. Blaster. <laughs> I think up this stairs. Oh, see, Steve does kick off. Alright. He gets a bit grumpy if you hang around him too long. <laughs> Because he thinks you're after Pugman's loot, and he don't know if you're Pugman. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. oh, I think there's a jerk around here. Oh, yes, there is. Move it, Chris. Whoa! <sighs> Would you jump at me, sir? Trying to hop over the banister. Rude bugger. That was calm and collected, Pug. Well done. Now, see, okay, question to the Resident Evil experts out there. This door. Huh? There's a numeric key panel. Yeah. You don't know the pass number. How do you open that door? That door leads to the other side where the zombie was munching on somebody. Huh, it's like a shortcut. Yeah, I'll show you on the map. Well, it's hard to me to explain, but... So we're in the red section. We're in the red section, and... The northmost door? The north door, yeah, exactly. Hmm. I don't know. How would you have come across but that But we've thing? been in the other room, you see. We just haven't opened the door. Hmm. We don't need this crappy key anymore. Good. Tons of space now. Maybe a little top-up on your shotgun shells. She only got three in there. Okay, we'll do. Crows. Oh, look they're at, dead. Look at this room. They're stuffed. They're stuffed crows. I do see shotgun shells. And what's this? Ooh, Ooh. more magnum rounds. The more the merrier. So is your magnum more powerful than your shotgun? Oh, yes. Wait till you see that baby chip pants. <laughs> okay, orders. Top secret. So the head of sec it's top secret, which is laying out on the desk here. <laughs> to the head of the security department, X day is approaching. Complete the following orders within the week. Number one, lure the members of STARS into the lab and have them fight with the BOW in order to obtain data of actual battles. Now, BOWs, we know that from number five, Japan's uh, biological organic, organic weapons. Organic weapons, think, yeah. yep. Mm -hmm. Basically, bosses. Um, Number two, collect two embryos per bow type, making sure to include all species except for tyrants. Number three, destroy the Arclay lab, including all researchers and lab animals, in a manner which will seem accidental. White umbrella. What? Ooh, tricky sods. All right, so step one's been done. The brain snake ate your pants. Now, there's a little hidden thing in this room, which you need to get the magnum. If you switch this light off here, yes, you see a little twinkle in the eye. Ah, someone's this. looking out from behind the moose. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Perverts. Right, remove this over here. I think we can climb up. Could you do that if the light was? Um, I don't know. You know. We will take the red jewel. Any I already idea know. Where, of course I know, Pugman. You know man. where this might go? Yeah. Down in the in the tiger. Bingo. You already put your bluey in there, and he likes blue and red. <laughs> He's going to be one happy tiger. Mm-hmm. Got two eyeballs now. There's another fool around here. I can hear him stump him. Look at <gasps> Oh, he can cut through the banister. He got you through there, Pug. I was being cheeky there. <laughs> Like I was looking at him through like a zoo cage. Grab my pants leg. <laughs> he got you good. Look, you're still green fine. We're still green. That was funny. Did you learn your lesson, Pug? I did. Don't mess with him. Don't taunt the zoo animals. Okay, go in 
here. It's still a maze. I, I kind of know it quite well. Oh my gosh, you're right there. I'm going to shove it in. Look at him. He's got two eyeballs. What else you got behind your butt? <laughs> he carries all sorts up his butt, this tiger. Oh, so if he spun one way, he gave you the crest. Yeah. Now we've got the cult python. What a gun. <laughs> what a gun. So when do we dump the shotgun and make this the primary? <laughs> Not yet. Not yet. Do you really do that? You're going to change the shotgun out completely. Are you going to carry them both? I'm going to change them out. We just don't have the room, Chip Pants. You don't have enough ammo either. You only, what, like, maybe got like three? Three lots? Let me think now. Have we got everything in this mansion? Look at the map. We've probably been everywhere. It's all green. There's one room down there that's obviously not filled in. Bottom right-hand corner. Die. That, I believe, is the changing room. We can't even go in that room until you complete, complete the game. game. Mm. Um, That's the Roomba, then. <laughs> You're starting to learn it, Chip. <laughs> Let's have a look at the second floor. Looks like we've been everywhere. So we're going to head back um, to where all the dogs are outside. and Put the battery in? Yes. I'm just trying to figure out the safest way to get back. There's multiple routes? Um, let me think. I'm going to go a different route. route. I'm, not going up I'm not going upstairs with uh, that dude that's slashing my pants. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not messing with that dude. You're, you're scared of that one now. Oh, a little bit. I want to go to a dining room. Where's that bloody dining room? Yeah. Yeah, like I've mentioned earlier, I like that the place is really free roaming now. You can't just go where you want. Right. Like you said, I mean, multiple paths to get to your objective. It's not linear. Mm-hmm. Here we go. Oh. Seems like eons ago we were in this dining room. I know, right? Here's another thing, Chip Pants. If you open this door... Don't want to do that. <laughs> you have a dog shaking his head at Here's you. Here's Johnny. <laughs> the Shining. The Shining people. I haven't seen that movie in a long time. It's, it's a good one. Can't beat a bit of Jack Nicholson. <laughs> Look like there's a curtain back there for a puppet show. Oh ah! god, spiders. The dogs have upgraded to spiders. They've transformed. Transformer dogs. <laughs> Just don't mess with the spiders. That's my advice. That would have been cool if there was a cyborg in this game. You've oh, oh, flip. Oh, oh. Eat that. <gasps> oh, yeah. Okay. You're okay. Oh, God. You're yellow fine. You're fine. You realise I don't have any... I know. Don't worry about it. I'm a little bit worried. Boom. Do it again. Oh. <sighs> You're probably just on caution. You're fine. You, sir. I don't like you. <laughs> I just don't like you. That was mean, Pug. That was bad to the bone. <laughs> Give me a shock like that. Just popped around the corner, didn't he? Gotta be on my A-game, shit pants. You are on A-game. you Chris Redfield, for crying out loud. Uh, that, is, that is true. Alpha team. And maybe not Barry Burton. Not Barry Burton. Was Barry Burton A, Alpha or Bravo? How dare you ask a question like that, Chip? Of course he was Alpha. Okay. Have you not seen his beard? <laughs> That's an Alpha beard. <laughs> okay, I think the save room's in here. Yeah, this looks familiar. Yes, sir. Let's dump our junk off. Dump the junk in the trunk. Okay. Feel better? 
Babe, you should give a little save too, Pug. Get the ribbon out. Okay, I will do. I will do. And and just eat one of your crappy greenies, your single greenies. Will that make you happy? It will. I'm thinking what else I might need. Uh, battery. <clears throat> yeah, we're gonna need the battery. Um. Where's the battery? I wonder if I'm going to need the crank. It's still uh, recessed water. Do you need to pop up the water again? Yeah, that's exactly what we're going to do. I'm going to take the crank. Where is the crank? I'm going to eat the herb and give me another space. And I'm going to be risky, Chip Pants. I'm not going to save this time. Ooh. Living on the edge. I'm gonna wait because we're gonna leave the mansion now. So I guess this game is where Chris started going all crazy, losing team members. Right? Yes, quite possibly, yeah. Um. But more in the BS when he joins the BSAA, Chip Pants. Oh, hold on. Oh, what a dodge. Eat oh that, yo. Oh, my God. Ooh. I didn't know you could still dodge these guys. I bet he's pissed in there. <laughs> they know how to open doors. I saw him in the cutscene. <laughs> yeah, what's that about? One zombie learning to open a door. Don't know. Super oh, smart zombies. The... Whoa, whoa. Well, that's not a good start, is it, really? You got plants back there. And I'm sure there's tons coming up too, so don't you worry about it. Okay, we need to head back down. Yeah, we still got Becca back here, don't we? She can juice you up. She's, yeah, she's peeing about somewhere. Oh, them snakes again. If you kill this load, will they come back? I've, I've never even tried to kill them. I'm not sure you can. Maybe you can. Oh, good. Give me a good heel stomp like another world. <laughs> now I have to quickly leg it and put this battery in while the dogs don't see me. They didn't even acknowledge Oops. a press. Ooh, what? Put the battery in there. Done. Now we can use I think, this elevator. Let's get up there. Nice. Oh, no. Crap. How's my health? Yellow fine. Okay. Leg it. We'll Leg it in zigzag, friends. That's what you got to do. Oh. 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 Is this the same section we were just at? Yes. But I used a different elevator. Huh. Now I'm going to switch, use the crank to switch that fountain. The... I'm going to fill this up, this dam, or whatever the hell it is. It's uh -huh. confusing as hell, really. We'll call it the koi pond. Oh, Ooh, I'm a cautious. cautious. Be cautious. Okay, so we shut that off. I'm going to take the herb. Right, we can't cross there, but we can use the other elevator now. Okay. So we're going to head back. Easy does it. And always pick up those herbs. We run. So oh, frick. Fine. Oh, crud. Fine. You're fine. Everything's good in the world. <laughs> that white thing on the wall is a map. Do you need it? No, it doesn't do anything, really. <laughs> Just black it, friends. Just black ain't, it. Ain't that like a pug? Don't need no directions. <laughs> right, I'm going to head back to the cabin, or whatever the hell it is, and I'm going to save there. The dorms? Yeah. Security dorms, that's what they're called. Mm -hmm. Well, actually, well, do I have room? There's a plant there. You got bit like three times. What was your health? Yellow fine. You're doing fine. 
Oh. For the heck of it, let's just take a blue one. <laughs> Mix it up. If you were to take a, a bluey, would that still juice up your HP? The blue only cures poison, but okay. if you mix it with a green, it'll heal you and cure poison. Okay. So I'll mix those two in a second. You're going to have to explain why you filled back up the koi pond. Oh, you'll see in a second. I will show that. But I'll have to kind of explain it quickly because of them damn dogs. Oh. Unless you've got some sausages on your chip pads. You can throw to them. I don't put a fresh out. Actually, let's mix those herbs. Might as well take it. You think? Yeah, why not? Um, mm. think. Do I need to crank? Do I need to crank? I don't know. I'm going to have a think while I save it. If you've got space for the crank, then I would just take the crank. You would take everything. You'd take the kitchen sink if you could. Uh, I could. I'd be dragging around a big Christmas <laughs> Santa bag. Let's save it. You know, I think I need to crank, so we're going to take it. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, definitely going to need a shotgun. Got it. Check. Going to take some first aid with me. Magnum. Combat take knife. Anything else? Maybe one more mixed up. You never know. You never know. Do I need anything else? No. Nope. Okay, so now I'm going to show you uh, why I... Use that crank, switch that fountain off, or the water. So we're going to be heading now, down to the sewers. If they are sewers, it's just basically some crud under the, under the mansion. <laughs> Sounds like the sewers. I like his footsteps. Sounds like he's got high heels on. <laughs> you like that, do you, Pug? It relaxes me. Mm-hmm. All right. Oh, we haven't been this way. Right, this thing here had a waterfall. The water was crashing down on it and we couldn't get through it. Oh. So we got rid of that so we can now go down. Oh, this bit's tricky. Don't like the sewers. You, you got any swamp people down here? This is where they live. Oh. I think it is. Why is there a typewriter down here? That, that's my question. <laughs> so in case the owner uh, had a hit of inspiration, in case his muse hit. Ah, uh, so this bit here, a hexagonal hole. We need a new crank for that and we can't go any further. Oh. The hole is opened and I can't jump over it. Well. So that's a dead end. Where the heck am I going? I think you're going back. Let's just go in this door. Oh, hello. What we got? We uh, take a flamethrower. Yes, we will. That's a big tin four. Oh no! Oh, Another thing. The, yeah, a little lever there. Basically, what it does, you can't open a door without putting this flamethrower back. Oh. Stops you from stealing chip pants. That's a good little safety mechanism. Or, Pugman. Yeah. You could put your shotgun up there. <laughs> Chris is banging his head. No, no, chip pants. <laughs> not putting a shotgun up on there. <laughs> Keeping a shotgun. I don't know. A flamethrower sounds like it'd come in handy. Do I have it equipped it? No, let's uh, equip it. It's dark, Pug. It is dark. It's spooky too. Can I get in here? You know what these look like? It's a bunch of post-its. Enrico! <laughs> Don't come any closer, Chris. Wait, what happened? 
double-crosser! Don't! What the hell did he just shoot himself in the head? Uh, umbrella. Umbrella. That was his last word. Who is it? I is someone there? Oh, I hear footsteps. Double-crosser? What did he mean by that? What is this? <laughs> More importantly, what, what have you got in your body? Anything I might want to use? Could he not just give us a little bit more information before he offed himself? He couldn't have moved because of this injury. He's holding something. A crappy magazine. I don't care about that. No. That's what he's holding. Huh. Oh, hello, you. Flame him. Flame him. Flame him. That flame actually looks really good graphic. You don't like actually hurt. I do. I hear. I hear some more. Oh god. You got some more juice for him. Oh god! Come on. Ooh, it gave you a little slap. Ellen Ripley style. That has to be like a real life flame graphic, don't you think? It is actually. Yeah. Oh, a sparkly thing. Crank. That's the crank we need, but we don't have enough room. Let me. Use a herb. Yeah. And then we'll pinch the crank. Hexagonal he crank. Good stuff. So who shot in Rico chip pets? Well, no clue. Who's the dirt double dirty crosser? Oh, hold on. Poof. Poof. Come on, yeah. Stay back. Got me. Oh, there's another one. It's alright. Is okay. he burning? Oh my god, I'm out, I'm out of flame, bloody frabber. That didn't last long. You're still green fine. He's only a half cut toad. <laughs> oh. Yellow fine. Let's see, they are mean buggers, these things. So you can't even dump the flamethrower here, you have to put no, it right back you... in its socket. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here walking. Be that ugly. Again. Whoa, whoa. Got a bit cheeky. That one's a bit lively. Okay, let's put the old flame for our back. They're like the coins at the airport in the carts. Yeah, you. I'm not gonna let you out until you put the coin, you know, the cart back. <laughs> you get those in like Ireland and stuff for uh, borrowing a. A cart in a supermarket. Yeah, they're starting to spread out. You've got to put a dollar in. Because otherwise everybody's just pinching them, I guess. <laughs> Play Mario Kart in them. <laughs> right, and put the crank in the, in the hole. Ooh. And yes, friends, we are moving a wall. With a little crank. So what's that doing? Why are you... That is just crazy. It fills up the hole. There was a hole? Are you paying attention, Chip Pants? Yeah. Nice. Okay. Yeah, let's have a reload of that. Yes. Oh, Ooh. another flamethrower. Don't mind if I do. Is there you... any fools around? No. Okay, let's grab it. Yes. Saves on your shotgun shells. That's, That's true. That is true. It's not the best of weapons. It doesn't shoot very far, but it will cook a toad or two. It's flashy, though, Pug, in case anybody's getting tired of... Oh, hello. What do we have here, chip pants? It's a boulder. Back in, of course, Resident Evil 5, Chris would punch, punch his way through that. I say no problem. This time we got to run. Oh my God. Indiana Jones style, but it is Indiana Jones style. What's he think? Oh, slick. He, yeah, he's out of breath. He's just getting his breath back. He ran five steps. Right. Did that? Oh, footsteps. Music's changed too, Pug. Go on. They eat flying, I believe. 
Hey, they change colors too, like they use charboils. He's cooked, isn't it? You want a frog's leg? I'm good. <laughs> okay, that door, I believe that's a boss in there, Chance. What you gonna do, Pugman? Uh, what you gonna do? I think there's some hidden loot back here. Do I have room? I don't have the room. Alright, Magnum ammo. We're gonna come back for that, that's for sure. Alright. As soon as you dump the flamethrower, you'll have room. Oops, wrong way. Past the bloody toad. Oh, there it is. Okay, I'm gonna use the old shotgun for this dude coming up. Why not the flamethrower first? I don't like it, chip pants. You don't feel comfortable. I like Mr. Blasty. Okay. Do you have a. Uh, I think you have a first aid spray on you. I do, but I'm gonna save it to when I get desperate. Get on, Uglace. Ooh, 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 on the move, Pug, on the move. No, I'm just gonna take it to the face. There you go. Come <laughs> on. Flame him, Pug, flame him. Bosh. Maybe not. Spider oh. guts everywhere. I will have a spider leg. Oh, you're poisoned. Oh, I'm poisoned. Did you just say you want a spider leg? Crispy uh, oh, oh, little babies. babies! Disgusting, you can't squish them. Just stomp them! Stomp! I'm stomping Flame them! Pen. Flame them! Actually, maybe I should flame them. <laughs> They're kicking my ass. Uh-huh. Sod that, I'm going out, shit pants. There was something sparkling in there. Maybe it's health. Maybe it's a poison fixer. Let me grab the... Um, where was the loot? Down here. Yeah. If I drop dead from poison... You're not going to blame me. I might do. <laughs> now, there's something in that room. Maybe it's a poison fixer. Yeah, I'm coming back. I'm coming back. No, that's not the place. Wait, wait, wait. What are you doing? Are you going to clean out the babies first? I think they go away when I leave. Oh. Okay, that's good. These little babies have gone. Nice. That little sparkly thing over here yeah. is a knife. We don't need it. <laughs> Why? We're too tough for that. I'm going to use the flamethrower. You need the knife to burn this dirty web down. Okay. You need the knife to... Okay. Yeah, you can cut it if you run out of flame juice. I see. The spider wasn't that tough, really. He got your poison, though, Pug. He did get us poisoned. We are going to have to sort that out. You know what? I should have brought that bloody blue herb, shouldn't I? Is there yeah, blue herb around here? There you go. Nice. Okay, we'll sort that out. Do you still need your cranky doos? I think I do, you know. Um, You're going to need to put that back. Maybe the magnet huh. can go. Yes, Magnum can go. I'm going to put this down for now. While I um, grab this herb. And you do, take I, do I have a spare green one to mix it with? That'd be handy. There I you do. go. Let's combine them up. And swallow. No, you yellow fine. Not too bad. There's a spray here. Yes, we will. Something sparkling on that side. I bet it's a ribbon. Normally, it's, it's normally ribbons when it's next to typewriters. Mm, fair enough. I will have a quick save, I think. Yeah. I don't really want to do that again. Yes. <laughs> Did well. Yeah, so far, so good. Can you use the typewriter? Yes, you're right. No, I feel better. Okay, let's reorganize. Don't need that. Gotta get your flamethrower back. Yes, we do need the flamethrower. Leave the spray. 
You might want to take the spray because you'll have that extra room as soon as you put back up the flamethrower. That's a good point, Chip Pants, but I think we're good. Okay. There's always stuff as you're walking around anyways. <gasps> Snake yeah, that, babies. Don't mind dirty snakes. Okay, we've got to put the flamethrower back here to open this door up. Can we use it? There you go. Nice. You need to equip a new gun. Before you give me a heart attack. <laughs> you happy? Yes. Well, another Indiana Jones bit. Um, hexagon hole. Got just the crank for it. <laughs> ah, you're going to make the gap. I don't understand why how he's twisting a whole room around, mind <laughs> you. We've got to use this again, I think. Oh, so you can... Uh... Basically, it opens up a door to the left there. Oh. So we can dodge this stupid boulder. Tap, tap, tap. Yeah, Chris would punch the crap out of that later <laughs> on in his life, in his career. <laughs> It's smarter than Chris Redfield. There's a map of the underground. Will you take it? Yes. What do we have in here? Ooh, another MO disc. So we got two or three. MO disc means no problems. And let's check in here. Anybody here? Oh, this is a puzzle room, I think. If you tread on that, it opens Ooh. up this thing. It's like crystal maze, Japan. That scared me. Right. So, of course, we need that. We need put this statue on it, on it, but we can't. I can't move it across. What? There's a little cranky do on the wall here. Okay. Hexagonal. Oh, nice. Bingo. Who built all this? It's taken ages building all these little puzzles. It's and... quite a security measure. Okay, if we push that on the little stone. Will you take the Doom Book too? Yes. So we got one and two. Got, got it. One and two. How many do we need? That's all we need. Okay. It reminds me, I need to get the other Doom book now. I'm going to head back to the safe room. Is it this way? You're on it. Okay. <gasps> oh, watch the snakes. Just keep legging it. Can you not just walk around on their heads? <laughs> I wouldn't want to try. <laughs> So let's grab the dome box. Do you not need the mo at the moment? Okay, I need that one. Don't need the mo disc. I don't think so. Where's the? Do I have the other book? You do. It's a good Where's read. The other, where's the other dome book? Don't need the cranks anymore. Thank God for that. Both of them? Okay. It's done that crud. Um, You're yellow fine. Else. Let's take some herbs. And maybe one... How many more saves do I have? I thought you had quite a few more. I bet I do, somewhere. You just picked up one too, I think. Oh, we've got a bunch of... Look at all these ink ribbons. We're good. And some of them have more than one in there. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm gonna save it here. Oh, 
Right, friends. I think we're going to leave it there for now. Ah. But we'll see you on the next video where we're going to use these awesome dome books. Chris going to use a smart. Chris is going to read a book or two. <laughs> Should be interesting. <laughs> see you on the next video, friends. Save and quit.